Well, let's see. These can be branded into silver blades. All of these runes can. That one seems to be pretty good. 10% damage and plus 25% knockdown. 25% incineration and blinding. Increases opponent's sensitivity to silver. that and that imbeciles I knew you'd be back sooner or later. You missed a lot. Greetings, Vincent. Why are you here? I'm responsible for King Radovid's safety while he's in Temeria. We'd be deep in it if anything would have happened to him. Has Foltest returned? Yes. He's an old Vizima. Knowing whose orders we're following really boosted morale. I need to get into old Vizima. I stand a chance of getting in alone, but not with... Do you follow? What's going on? I have a job for you, Dandelion, regarding King Radovid. The Witcher's flapping tongue would be a liability. Why do I think you're up to something? It's true. I'm not suited to converse with kings. Done. Dandelion, wait for me at the king's camp. Geralt, do what you must. Well, that was nice of him. Thank you, Geralt. Thanks again. How are the girls? They still speak of you. Shani and I have become friends. Good. I hope she's well. She treats the sick and wounded no matter their race. Not all look kindly on that. I see. Unfortunately, I haven't seen her since it all began. I'll try to find her. Farewell. Greetings, Geralt. Your Highness. Congratulations on the Professor. Pompous twit tried to blackmail me once. Thanks for the good news. My pleasure. What brings you here? I want to finish off Salamandra. Good. Finish the bastards. What's the situation in Vizima? Total chaos. But thanks to my agents, Foltest returned and is trying to restore order. I see. I'd like to be on my way, sire. Farewell. Okay, and one more. I think Sultan was around here. There you are. Ah, you're in time for quite a scrap. Looks quiet. Oh, quiet at the front. Here they clash, there they grunt, and again. Oh, quiet at the front. Yeah, even one. Almost all Vesima's non-humans took up arms. How'd that happen? When the Order started killing women and children, even the most assimilated elves rebelled. Dumbest move since the age of King Desmod. Maybe the Grand Master wanted to provoke non-humans. As if that wasn't enough, rumors surfaced about non-humans being resettled in all Vesima because we're more susceptible to plague. Fucking fairy tale, of course. What are you doing here? We need to repel the attacking knights. Then I want to lead the civilians and Shani's patients out of old Vizima. Shani's in old Vizima? She's organized a kind of field hospital. She mentioned you. I'll try breaking through to her. Oh, great. The 
Morning Star rises. Um, they will just keep coming, no I suppose. Further. Understood. Defend yourself, bum! Oh no. I do not fear death. Oh damn, dude. that was a lot of them. Is that the only way in? Supply that. And uh, I don't want to meditate, so... White honey. Help! Look at me. What we shall. The Elven Star rises. Let's make a run for it. Here, we made it. Chapter 5. Uh, gracious sire, this is madness. You should not expose yourself to such danger. Wait here and allow me to summon a stronger force. Nonsense, Velarad. This is my city, the capital of my kingdom. Damn it, I rule this land, and I refuse to creep around its corners. Hey, gracious sire! Silence! You know you might as well wipe your ass with those intelligence reports. I want to see it with my own eyes. Non-humans attacking! Uh, protect the king!
It's the Grand Master. We're saved. You return, sire. I trust you are not too late. Your kingdom is in need. You should know kings are never late, Jacques. Sire, flames engulf half the city, and the blood of your subjects fills the gutters. This is no time for word games. You must act. What do you propose? Allow me to command your army, and the freedom to do as I see fit. Never. Over my dead body. It was close this time. Next time, I might arrive too late to help. I've seen enough. Velorad, back to the castle. Ah, there we are. Took some time. What is he doing here? He dropped in. He seems to have a talent for that. What shall I do with him? He'll come with us. I have a matter to discuss with him. Witcher of Rivia. Sire, I am honored. As I'm sure you surmised, I have not summoned you here out of whim. A serious matter weighs upon us. A curse binds my daughter. I want you to remove it. I have gathered all who might offer aid. Duet has been the princess's adjutant for the past half year. Velorad has known Ada since her childhood. And Triss Merigold is here for her extensive knowledge of magic and female intuition. Mm -hmm. Consult them and think upon this matter. We shall speak about it again soon. As you wish, your highness. In the meantime, equally urgent issues demand our attention. I'm listening, sire. Witcher. Imagine returning home from an excursion against a monster, a Kikimor, for instance, only to discover your home a whorehouse. Your Highness. I'm not finished. Those you left in charge failed you. A traitor threatens to oust you from the home of your ancestors. Wouldn't you be angered? Would you not elect to shed more blood? Forgive me, sire, but we witchers don't meddle in politics. Yes, the famed neutrality. Alas, that is a luxury I cannot afford. Both sides chose my city as a battleground. Both will be duly punished. I understand, sire, but how can I help? You could start by being more enthusiastic about aiding a king. You could offer to slay whomever I choose. Forgive me, sire, but... Silence, Witcher, before you say too much. Rulers don't enjoy being refused more than once. I'm certain you're right, sire. I must attend to some urgent matters. Speak with these excellent minds, gain their insight, and don't forget. Yes. All right, there we go. I think it works yes. again. Let's have to reboot a, a little bit. Where did where did the king go? Yes. Our merciful master won't permit you entrance. He'll send for you. I see. Of 
because we can't see the king. Witcher, Count. No titles, please. Let us bury past misunderstandings in the name of a greater cause. So be it. Geralt. The king wants me to lift the curse that holds Ada. Not surprising. You succeeded once, though it nearly cost you your life. The Striga's appearance possibly spells the end for Foltest. Many say he offended the gods. Remember how she first became a Striga? Remind me. As a youth, Foltest had quite an appetite. So much so that he plowed his own sister. Their child died at birth, but then continued to grow in its coffin, only coming out to feed. Then you arrived and broke the spell, though apparently not completely. The Striga's reappearance proves the royal dynasty is cursed. The people are sensitive to such signs. No wonder Foltest wants you to kill the Striga. I thought I was supposed to lift the curse. You are to keep the Striga from becoming an eyesore. The chance of removing the curse is minimal. I've heard a rumor of an additional reward for killing the Striga. I'm not interested in rumors. You should be. It's your choice, Witcher. But give it some thought. Farewell. If the king wants us to lift the curse, then why should we kill it? Geralt, I was worried about you. I worried too. I'm proud of you. Heard how you fought for Alvin. Horrible things are happening in Vizima. True, but the king has placed me under his, um, protection. Tell me, where's Alvin? Uh, Alvin vanished into thin air one day, despite the amulet I gave him. Vanished? That's awful. He might be anywhere in time and space. I had hoped the amulet would block those abilities. I hope he'll be all right. Triss, I've been thinking about us. Oh, Geralt. Oh, great. We're gonna need to confess. Well, she don't. She don't. Doesn't have to find out about Shani. Or someone else. Ada. Someone else. That's in the past. I love you. I want to be with you no matter what. Love is the sole thing of beauty in these rotten times. Geralt. I could change, take fewer risks. We'd find Alvin, live together. I'd build a house. A that, house? That was not what I thought. Dream. You could breed horses and sheep. I'd tend the garden, cook meals. We'd sell what we grew to buy copper pots, iron rakes. We'd age with dignity. Evenings you'd play bagpipes of your own making as a remedy for my gloom. I'm no. sorry. I didn't mean to... Geralt, say something. I can't lose you. I'm here. These are trying times. We just need to survive. We can dream again when the madness passes. Triss, I... I love you too, Geralt. To the end of time. Okay, I was afraid she was going to tear us a new one when we told about Alvin. Lucky, we, lucky she didn't. So red of you. Who are you? Wish on a star, a witcher in my native Beauclair in the Duchy of Tucson. A witcher once spent an entire holiday feast dancing with a sorceress. Not I, my lady. I dance rather poorly. Hmm. Do all witchers have white hair? No, my lady. I am alone in that. Perhaps I am confused. Regardless, I do have a certain matter for you. How can I help? Très bien. Mon dieu. My three cousins recently fled the city due to some uh, unfortunate coincidences. Did they incur the king's disfavor? Of a sort. I wish to send them some coin to alleviate their situation. Understand? Perfectly. I'll act as messenger for an appropriate fee. Ah, parfait! My cousins Corbin, Bus, and Ramaro sought refuge in the swamp, in the caves there. Please deliver 300 orents to each of them. As for my fee... My cousins will give you a receipt. 
Take these to Ovezima, to the captain of the mercenaries, my fiancé. He will reward you. Farewell. Okay. Hold on, where did he go? There's one more here. Greetings, Guild. Greetings, Velarad. I saw you uh, speaking with the king. I gather it was unpleasant. It could be worse. Geralt. The king told me about Ada. Dreadful. You warned us it might return. Uh, can you break the spell a second time? We'll see. You seem to remember last time well. Certainly. You stayed from dusk till dawn in the old manor house where the Strigger had her sarcophagus. Kept half the city awake with the noise you made. We uh, went to the manor at dawn and saw the two of you lying on the floor by the sarcophagus in a pool of blood. You were barely breathing, but the princess was cured. With the traitor Ostrid dead, the king was overjoyed. Who was Ostrid? He cast the curse out of jealousy. He loved the king's sister. Hmm. Many victims this time round? I don't know. These days, the corpse is like thicker than flies on a pile of manure. Know where the Striga sleeps in daytime? No, but she's been seen in old Vizima. Uh, she may hunt there. Removing the princess's curse will be risky. True, but the king has ways of encouraging you to do it. We'll see. Do what you will, but remember, Foltest loves his daughter very much. I know. Geralt. Aren't you a bit afraid, Velarad? The king looked irate. At me? I'd watch what I say if I were you. Hmm. I've served Temeria all my life. If they condemn me, I'll hold my head high as I walk to the gallows. Farewell. All right, fair enough. Geralt. What do you think about the situation with Ada? She's a Striga, Geralt. We both know that curses don't cast themselves. Any theories? Years ago, when you first removed the curse, you ordered the princess to wear a necklace with an inclusion. Juniper, broom, and hazel branches were to be burned in her chambers. Don't tell me. Someone replaced the necklace and added crap to the fire. Yes. Someone close to her who knew the secret. Velared might know something. So you think I should aid the king? Definitely. In a sense, I'm a political prisoner. I could teleport away, but that would be highly inappropriate, and I still have a few matters to settle here. Namely? I can't tell you. For the time being, my position is tenuous. If you help Foltus with the Striga, maybe you could vouch for me. I could resolve a few things and go free. How about it? If that's what you want, Triss. Thank you, Geralt. My endgame with Salamandra draws near. I know. I'd like to help you. How? Have you heard of Gnomic Armor? I'd need a skilled armorer to remake it. Someone with great knowledge of metals. Hmm. Kalkstein. He's an old Vizima. He's certainly not short on knowledge and would help you. What do you think happened to Alvin? Frankly, I never guessed he'd bypass the Dimeridium. That would be a feat for many sorcerers. Mm -hmm. Clearly, he has enough power to teleport himself anywhere, perhaps even through time. I've got to go. Oh, there was more to talk about. Geralt. Or not? I've got to go. Our merciful master will see you now, sir. Go upstairs to his chambers. I'll go immediately. Geralt? Don't you fear the king's anger, Duet? Wherever did you get that idea, Witcher? Foltest looked pretty pissed. He said something about bloodshed. 
Obviously, he spoke of the blood of traitors and non-humans. He might finally dispose of that failure, Velerad. Farewell. Geralt. Farewell. Okay, that's all of them. Let's go up. Yes? Witcher. Your Highness. No need for titles. Speak freely. You've had time to think. What's the prognosis on removing the curse from my daughter? It's possible. Could the curse have returned by itself? Unlikely. Someone must have cast it again. Should you succeed, would... Would Ada's mind be that of a child? I don't believe so. She'd likely recall all that occurred before her transformation. You don't believe so? You're not making this any easier, Geralt. Do what you can to remove the curse. Failing that, you may slay her without fear of retribution from me. When I last gave you my trust, you did not disappoint me. Thank you, sire. Don't thank me yet. Should you learn who cast the curse, tell me and only me. If you succeed, I'll grant your every wish within reason, of course. If you must slay her, do it quickly, cleanly. If you fail, and my daughter suffers, those dear to you will suffer too. I understand, sire. Good. Sire, another disease consumes your kingdom. What would that be, Witcher? I have been investigating an organization known as Salamandra. My daughter dealt with them, stupid girl. I regret I ever departed. To your credit, Venerad said you thinned their ranks considerably. I trust you shall finish the matter. Exactly my aim. One last matter, Witcher. Forgive me, but I had you followed. I received a report about your personal life. Your Highness. Uh, okay. You must know that I hardly did this out of lewd curiosity. My spies report that you are romancing Merigold. I need to know if there is anything more to it. Uh, okay. Triss and I, we're close. That's no one's business but ours. No need to be rude, Witcher. I too loved Adder's mother. They forbade me from marrying her. But I hope you fare better. At least as a mutant, you need not worry about pregnancy. If you desire to go to Vizima, talk to my Chamberlain. I shall be away from the castle for some time. See Velorad about any other needs. So I shall. Farewell, sire. One more thing, Witcher. Yes, sire. This is, um, confidential. So you must pledge these words will not venture beyond these walls. I shall take right. them to the grave with me. My spies tell me you play poker. And, well, I have trouble finding worthy opponents at court. They fear I would have their heads if I lost. Care to play? Well, of course. Still, oh, damn. You can bet pretty hard, yeah. Ah, uh, let's go for it.
Oh, that's rubbish. Well, we lost. I must attend to other matters now. I shall detain you no longer. Talk to my Chamberlain about transport to Vizima. I shall detain you no longer. Talk to my Chamberlain about transport to Vizima. Hmm. That is bad. We can't replay it? I shall detain you no longer. Talk to my Chamberlain about transport to Vizima. I mean, I guess we have to defeat him in order to complete the quest. So let's just speed talk through everything again. Oh, wait. I must attend to other matters now. Get out. I I'm, I'm I love you. The kid will sleep. No room with you. Aren't you a bad one? Farewell. No, no, how to. Perfect. Countless the key not room the I knew the child am you fair. Don't wait for fair. Girl. I'd need Calkstein. What she any years ago don't you do me if they Okay, that's it. Yep, there we go. Oh, well. So before we talk to him, we make a save. Yes. Yes. You're not a clown, shall you think? If I could swap my tea, you're a human. Trist, they if so, yes, I'm a baker. Go for it. Go through your kind. If we won. Beautiful. That's a lot of gold. I'm a poker legend. I must attend to other matters now.
Yes. I'd like to return to Vizima. Are you ready, sir? I am. Old Vizima, Executioner's Tower, Breaching Wall, Eel Hospital, we're gonna find Shani there. Coxin, that's where we're going first. Okay. A gift from the gods. Shani told us about you. We met at St. Lebioda's Hospital in the Temple Quarter. I heard Shani set up a hospital. We tried going there, but with the fighting, we can't possibly manage alone. Knights of the Order and Scoyatel are fighting in every street and square. Their rule is, if you're not with us, you're against us. I'm glad I didn't get drawn into the war. Will you help us reach the hospital? Stay close to me. I'll try to avoid any fighting. All right, let's see here. City guards. Right, get ready. 